Joe's Place provides for the students there just a real stability uh, uh, during the whole the whole purpose and mis mission is to um, retain students who are in a real tenuous living situation stability during their high school days so that they will uh, be able to, to graduate so provide stability um, a caring environment you know food it really provides some some of these students um, their living situation and and the transients you know going from couch to couch or family to member to family member it just really doesn't provide them opportunity to play sports or be involved with plays or just really engage high school as as they should just as as any student should have that opportunity so it also provides them to fully engage high school and to really become and do the things that they want to do the fundraiser raises money just for the ongoing uh, operational expenses of, of the house so it's um, you know it's purely privately funded so the, the the fundraiser money all goes to just the the yearly costs associated with housing uh, the boys at the house. So students get into Joe's Place, we have an intake process and one of the primary criteria is that they qualify under the mckinney Veto Act, which is federal legislation that defines what is homelessness mm -hmm. in education. So students have to meet that criteria first. And then um, from that point, the program committee, which, which is Mr. Estrada, uh, Ms. Donnell, Mr. Harchart, um, uh, uh, Joe's Place board member, um, myself, and then we start looking at at the student in terms of um, you know their their disposition would okay. be a good fit um, their need and then we always have boys in the intake process and it just sometimes their circumstances have to um, sometimes they choose to come into the house because it's voluntary sometimes they choose not to um, but we go through a process that we get um, parents or guardians involved to make sure um, that we're on the same page um, but at the end of the day, it's it's the student's choice to come in or not because um, it is voluntary. So uh, currently, we have three three boys at Joe's place. We have a senior uh, and uh, two juniors. This is the seventh school year of Joe's place. So it started um, six and a half years ago in, in in December. So it started the the first year Joe's place happened halfway through the school year. So this is the sixth and a half year, but the seventh school year that we've had uh, boys in the house.